All right, in this lecture, we're going to get the tools to be able to create the uh, SQL layer, which is the data layer, and get the PHP to talk to this. And to be able to do that, we're going to download a free tool that has all of it included in it. And if you're on a Mac operating system, the name is called WAMP. I'm sorry, MAMP. And M-A-M-P stands for Mac, and then you have Apache, so that's for the server. Then you have uh, MySQL and PHP. Okay, so let me write this down. So that's Mac, that's Apache, that's uh, M is for MySQL and P for PHP. All right, so just know that it's okay if you don't know it by heart. What matters is that uh, we, um, we are using it. Okay, so having said so, the next thing you also want to know is that if you're on Windows, you can use what's called WAMP which is basically the same, but instead of being Mac, it's Windows and so on. All right, and it's totally free to use. You can just go on Google and download that. And that's what we're about to do right now. Okay, having said so, let's go ahead and do this. So I'm going to, uh, to uh, my Chrome, Google Chrome, but you can go to a new web browser, open a new tab and just type download, download uh, Mump because I'm on a Mac. But if you're on a PC, um, just type download Womp. All right, and here is the link mamp.info en download okay but i'm sure you see it's just straight click there and once you're there just click on uh, mac os or windows and click on download so any of this version will do just fine now i've already downloaded it so that i can save you time and here it is i have my package and just follow the installation process now this will install mamp and mamp pro now the pro version is not free but you don't need it you can do everything with the free version Okay, so don't worry about this. All right, then click on continue and continue and so on. License agreement, agree. Then uh, the installation type, install everything and then click on install. Okay, I already have it, so I'm not going to do that. All right. Now, once you have MOMP installed, how do you launch it? Well, if you're on a, on a Windows, you just go to the program files and select the MOMP. And if you're on Mac, go to your application and locate the MOMP. Here it is. And inside of this, locate this MAMP, the one that has the elephant sign, and double click on it, and this will launch MOMP. Here we go. Now, the very first time that it launches, it's also trying to connect, and if your installation is fine, it will launch um, a web browser window, and it will go to this URL, which shows you if you're connected or not. If you're connected, it will say that you're connected because it will show all the information about your, your, um, your, um, your connection. So. I know that I'm connected to the local host on this port. So local host is this computer. Here is my username and password. And here is the socket that it uses. And here is an example how to connect with it to the PHP. Now, uh, you can also double check that you're connected on clicking on MAMP. And you have this interface that appears. And it shows that the Apache server is on because you guys see there's like a green sign. It means that it's connected. Same thing for the server MySQL. All right. Now you can get more information if you click on preference and you can see what version of PHP you're using. So I'm using the latest, but it's okay if you have a different version. Anything above five is good, okay? And then which ports I'm using for my SQL and so on. We're going to use that later, so just know that. And you can start and stop them um, as, as you wish. And then you can also uh, see where the web server files are. As you can see, this is the address to the web server. Uh, all the files that we will use, all the files that we will create to connect will be in this htdocs folder. All right, so that's it for Mump and Womp.